Welcome to another video. Walk on the wild side and I'm here in Blackpool. It's a bit of a funny morning. It's around about half past eight at the moment. And uh, it's so calm and so peaceful. Well, I'll say it's and a noisy truck goes past. But anyway, I'm on the promenade here, just north of the, north of the, oh, you want to see the views? I'll show you the views in a minute. It's absolutely, it's quite surreal. It really is. When you come out in the morning in Blackpool, you get to see things that are, well, it's just a different type. It's, it's so different to, you know, the middle of the day, obviously when all the people are out and at night, of course, when they're all falling out of the pubs and everything. But uh, anyway, Big news, the Starfly has arrived already. Christmas by the sea it doesn't start until the 15th, but the Starfly has arrived and I'm gonna be taking a walk down there and we'll have a look at them setting it up. They might even get it going before Christmas by the sea starts. Anyway, uh, let's get on with that and uh, I'll show you the scenes behind me. I'll just show you around. That's Cocker Square over there. I believe it's named after Dr. Cocker, an ex-mayor of Blackpool. That's the, is it the Liberties Hotel? It's now called the Caledonian Tower Hotel, I think. This is Middle Walk here. We're looking down Middle Walk there. Done a few videos on Middle Walk, but just look at this view, folks. Look at that, straight across. Morecambe Bay, I can see the, I can just about see the hills of the Lake District and I can see a little bit of Barrow in Furness as well. It's, and, and the sea as well, look how calm it is, the tide's in. Oh, wouldn't you just love to be here in Blackpool right now. And let's have a look this way, shall we, towards the North Pier, look at that. No helter skelter on the North Pier, of course, it blew off, it was somewhere about there <laughs> yeah but anyway i'm going to be heading down this way towards the tower and uh, we'll see how they're doing with the star fly i'll just come down onto the lower promenade because uh, i want to take a walk down this ramp here and uh, i'll bring you a bit of the the sea lapping up against the the wall down here, bringing you Blackpool, so you don't have to, if you don't get a chance to come here. Yeah, so Christmas, but it seems as though one thing ends and then another thing starts. So we've had the light pool, that's finished, and now it won't be long, 15th of November, and when we've got Christmas by the sea, but if they're putting the star flyer up now, then maybe that they'll be running that from this weekend. But anyway, this is how it looks. It just look at that, uh, look. You could just sit here all day, couldn't you? Just watching the time. Come in and then go out again. Well, they're doing a bit of work on the Metropole. And I'm just here by the, the Beer Monster shelters. A bit too early for the beer monsters, I think. Oh, I think I spoke too soon. I just heard a, a noise coming out of this one up here. I'll just give you a close-up of the North Pier. You might just be able to see there, there's a red section there. Uh, round about there. That's where the Helter Skelter was, yeah. I might have to go on there and... Uh, Check it out. So I'm now in front of the North Pier. There was a beer monster in that shelter. It gave me a right funny look when I walked past him. <laughs> but anyway, this is how the North Pier looks. We've got the Halloween. That's the North Pier bar there. Got some Halloween stuff for it. Are you getting into Halloween? We look towards Talbot Square, I can see a monster on top of a building there next to the town hall. Uh, there's monsters on top of a lot of the buildings, they're big inflatable monsters, which you can look out for if you come to Blackpool. You can just about see one, you see some eyes up there behind the town hall. 
that's just one of them. There's another one up here, actually, I'll show you when we get a bit further up. It's on top of the tower building. I'll tell you what, I'm starting to sweat now. I am, it's really, really mild. I can't believe it. I've only walked from the other side of the Metropole to the North Pier and I'm sweating. I think I need to take this jacket off. So this is how the promenade looks. We're just after nine o'clock now. It wasn't quite as early as what I thought. Uh, that build has never changed, has it? Robert's Oyster Rooms, yeah. And just over there, we've got Coyote Ugly. Check it out. That used to be the old Brannigans there as well. Coyote Ugly, you get girls dancing on the bar. Yeah. I think they had one in Manchester, someone told me. But I'm not sure whether the one in Manchester closed down, but we've got it in Blackpool now. Check it out, Coyote Ugly. So I'm just coming towards the tower headland now. And this is where it's all happening in November and they're all getting ready for it now. They're putting all the things together. The Christmas by the sea, the huts. Yeah, it's all going on here. Look at this. A lot of work going on. So, and just on the other side of the comedy carpet is where they're setting up the star fly. Yeah, so how many times has it been here now? It's the fourth time, I think, this. The fourth time. And I think that uh, of all the Christmas markets and things like that that we have in the country, this is probably the most unique one. Here in Blackpool, we do get a lot of people coming in for it. It's going to go on until, I think it's the 4th or 5th of January 2025. Now on the comedy carpet. Let's have a quick look at the tower, shall we? I'll show you that. Uh, we've got a, a bit of a, a monster going on there. And that'll light up at night. So, if you're coming to Blackpool, see if you can find all the monsters. Now then, yeah, this is the big ride. And when they put this thing up, it's so big, you can see it from miles around. And I have been on it every time. It's cut it's coming i didn't want to go in it the first time i thought oh my god you will never get me on that remember when they first built it a few years ago and they built it in st john's square and uh it well it turned out to be a bit of a bad idea it was a bit too close to the buildings i think it didn't really have enough room so they ended up having to bring it down here so originally they were going to put it up in st john's square but since they've placed it here on the promenade it's uh it, well it's where everything else is, isn't it? So why not place it right here on the promenade? Just here, we've got the Blackpool donkeys. Yeah, so they're on with this. Look, they're on with it. They're setting it up. Sky dance, it's called. Might be the same one we had last year. I don't know, they've got a few of them, apparently, and they go all over the place. They go all over Europe on the continent, Holland, Germany, you can see some of the huts over there, look, getting ready, there you go, that's the base of it there, look, it's magic how it all goes on a truck, it all fits on a truck, and then they can just open it all out, look at that, there you go. Take some putting together though. It's getting a bit busy on the promenade now. Let's have another look at the tower, shall we? They still haven't fixed that clock on the Woolworth building. I wonder if they ever will. So there you go, that was a little look at Blackpool. First thing in the morning, well not quite first thing, around about about half past nine now but yeah quite surreal really is if you get a chance to come out early in Blackpool do because uh, you see some amazing sights and it's so calm this morning and it's going to be calm for the next few into the weekend so if you come in it's uh, 
I think the weather should be half decent and uh, they might be set, have the star flight going for you as well if you want to have a little go on that. But I'm just walking through this at the moment, Spyro, which all lights up at night. It makes you a bit dizzy, actually, when you walk through at night, actually. But uh, anyway, that's it for this video. Um, like I say, uh, it looks like they're, they're setting it. I'm not sure if they are going to get it going before Christmas by the sea, but they're setting it up early. It looks like they probably are going to get it going before Christmas by the sea. Officially starts on the 15th of November. But anyway, that's it for this video. I hope you like it. If you do, hit the like button and also hit subscribe and tick the bell for notifications of new videos. And I'll see you again on the next one.